Chicken. 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 Hi there, so today I am going to be drawing something, I don't know what, but first I've got a weekly planner so I can just quickly write in, you know, what I need doing in any week. So I'm going to start this next week and hopefully keep up, um, you know, with all the following weeks after that, just with the same page really. So, you know, if it works out, all well and good. If it don't, then I won't be using it again. <laughs> Because I've already tried to work, you know, by a planning system, but I think if I stick with it, then much like I have with daily art videos, then I think I should get somewhere. So yeah, planning stuff, jolly good. So these are two illustrations that I really want to get finished, and then I can get these, you know, turn into art prints. Uh, this Phantasm Tall Man one and a Freddy Krueger without his hat or his uh, bladed fingers, you know, with his bladed glove or whatever. Um, possibly in the background of that, maybe a lot of greys to just help all this front bit pop. And this one, I'm not, still not sure about. Maybe some a few little skin tones on the face. Um, more on the chrome uh, balls and things. Um, I don't know whether to go over the colour uh, with some more greys and then over the top of that, um, I don't know, some kind of purple, but then I might just ruin it there, so I don't don't really know, to be honest. It's why some drawings just end up getting left, and, you know, I don't finish them for a while, so I come back to them. And, yeah, so I really want to get these finished. Um, try and just work on finishing artwork within the next few weeks and hopefully I'll have something that I can print out and sell as art prints and probably sell the original art as, as well once I've scanned it all in yeah so anyway yeah I might get on with these so I've got a light skin white here um, Copic marker just want to go over it slightly just lighten up the face only slightly I think it's best just to try and give it some kind of skin tone see that slowly coming through on the cheeks there Beep beep to you. Yeah, so the these are really good for skin tones. These I used to uh, get a few more um, various shades of skin tones and stuff just to maybe do more of this stuff. So, but I've got the basics for now. You can see a subtle little 
skin tone there. Let's see a bit better close up. There we go. Um, just trying to work on the the colours and stuff like that. But like I said, I don't want to do too much of that. Maybe a bit more on the on the head. to do is sort out these uh, chrome bollocks or <laughs> balls or whatever you want to call them. I think I'll start with this one because I haven't inked the blades coming out of it either so Not to worry, and maybe that blade's slightly bigger, but again, not to worry. Couple of lines I can use for the reflections of them. Again, it's the chrome stuff that you've got to work out. I'm using like cool greys as well for the the chrome which seems to work although I might definitely need some more shades so yeah form and the reflections that I've already sort of you know coloured in anyway so let's zoom back a bit. Oh, I'll need some darker greys on some of these bits. And go over some areas as well, make them more darker. cool grey then the darkest I don't want to do too much. Just uh, corners, reflections.
that's all I really want to do on that bit. I'll just flip the drawing over a bit and to work on the reflections on these chrome balls at the top. So I'm trying to get a, a good balance between light and dark. And if that means going over certain areas again with the same colour then that helps. Now I haven't inked the outside of the the chrome balls. Uh, I'm not entirely sure why. Uh, I think I was just going to do like chrome colouring and then that'd make up the the shape of it but now I'm not so sure if I need to ink that so I'll see once I've coloured these anyway. Let's see what it looks like. I think it's a long process of trying to balance between dark and light. I think it might need more darker areas there. Then I can sort of give it with these three cool grey pens, but I'll try and give it a go. So I'm starting to apply some um, polychrome pencils. I've got a warm grey polychrome or pencil and I'm just hoping that it'll uh, add a different type of shade that I want for these chrome balls. Um, yeah, not too sure at the moment. <laughs> Yeah, we'll see how it goes. Just don't know. It's all an experiment anyway. I haven't really done like much silver colours before. So I've just decided to fill in uh, a large portion of that suit in with um, um, a C7, which is a cool grey 7, Copic, and I think that looks a lot better than how I left it, because um, I couldn't really find any mid-tones to do that, and it was taking too long, so I just filled in that. I'm going to do some like highlights and more shadowed areas here just to make them stand out perhaps um, you know the edges of the suit maybe like the lights hitting it or something like that uh, yeah so we're getting there with this one um, yeah so yeah so I'd say this one's nearly finished it's just the background and the the chrome balls I'm not really happy with and uh, maybe some more tinkering here and there and some more little details maybe smooth this grey out a bit more maybe do some splatter effects right at the end but not too much of it and um, yeah it's come along though since I've I started this a good long while ago uh, in the summertime um, this one I'm trying to do the skin effects now I don't know if you can see that a bit because the lights a bit too bright let's move that further up there you can see a little bit better um, so yeah, I'm just trying to figure out all the skin effects with uh, I'm using Barely Beige and Skin White Which is somewhere... Oh, there it is 
yeah these two um, it's a lighter one of that one it's almost like skin color and I need to create some more burn like red sort of pizza face sort of markings uh, maybe down here and on the top of the head um, so yeah I've just got to colour on all the rest of the head and then do some sort of background colour which might include some more flames or I don't know it's all a choice a difficult choice to try and think of the colours sometimes um, in the case of this one in the background I thought about for a moment doing like um, blue um, over there but no it won't go and I like I like the grey colours so I think the grey colours are going to stay and I probably won't do anything over that I might extend the greys a bit more you know like uh, do some more grey warm grey tones just to fill out a bit but other than that I think it's near enough done that one to see how the splatter effects do I won't be going mad with that like I said so yeah it's been a difficult day trying to figure in this vlog around the other little bits of work that I need to do but you will see better videos from me um, I want to do some more tutorial things or things where I show you some techniques that I've learned and you know from other youtubers and things like that and drawing specific things rather than just seeing like glimpses of these which is nice to see but you don't want to see that all the time uh, you might want to see me like drawing proper stuff and you know I've still got that list of suggestions definitely to go through because I'd like to do that and yeah because there was some pretty good suggestions to draw and yeah and I'll probably start up that um, like a concept drawing thing on a Wednesdays again warm up Wednesdays that's what it is so I'll probably do that um, probably starting from next week and I've got lots of updates to try and show you with other stuff I'm trying to build it all up trying to plan things and just try and keep on with this because I think it's quite useful useful for my own head to get my head round finishing illustrations and just creating good content on especially on this channel yeah I'll just see how it goes really and when I do that um, horror fest thing I'm going to try and take my camera there and just see how that goes and you know I'm not really too good at mixing with other people but you got to get out of your comfort zone yeah, sometime otherwise you'll never do it so and plus I've been sort of like a, a hermit in this house drawing and thinking and you just got to get out sometimes so yeah We'll be doing that, and that's coming around quite quickly actually. Where are we at? It's the 20th of September, and that's on the 15th of October, so it's not long. So, yeah, got to get on with stuff, got to finish these. If I can finish these two tonight and show you on tomorrow, then that'll be good. But if I don't, then there's other drawings to do. So there. So I hope you, I hope you like that little update vlog video. I'm going to try and make these a bit more interesting as well, these vlogs. Maybe show you other stuff that I do during the day. Um, you know, even though sometimes it's just consists of me eating, um, drinking. That's about it. <laughs> so yeah. I'll see you in the next video. Cheers now.